Now, I... I don't even... <laughs> you look so stupid. <laughs> I think for sure, for sure, the first memory I can think of, like, that I... That you thought I loved her. Christmas, when we made hot chocolate together. We weren't even dating. And I said you loved you thought you loved me? Mm -hmm. Oh, that was we made hot chocolate, the creamy hot chocolate together, I and then watched that. Polar Express I because Polar that. Express is my favorite Christmas movie. And Brock was giving me crap. And I feel like that's the first time, you like, you like laid my your head on my shoulder or something. It's true. I always made the first move. Yeah, and so I was like, that was probably the first time because when when you laid your head on my shoulder, I was like, oh snap, my heart's happy. <laughs> so I think that's when it probably was. When you loved me. Yeah. Tom Brady mode entered. Tom Brady mode? Yep. I'll do, um, hmm, Drew Brees mode. Okay. Is that go? Oh. Slash. Oh, no way, dog. It's bigger than that. No. Five. Whoa, 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 whoa. I got done. Yeah, I got done. I got done. <laughs> This might be too soon, and you might think I'm crazy, but I love you. And then I said, I must be crazy too then, because I love you too. Oh. I remember that. Okay, but. <laughs> you don't I remember the first time I, I told you I loved you? I was probably nervous, because yeah, I'm going to say, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is golden hour. It is golden hour. Luke, from day one, it was like they had an instant connection. Truly really like something out of a movie. Something neither of us is able to describe, and it sounds so cheesy, but we both know how it felt. And all of our friends were just waiting for us to date. I'm not sure I'll ever be able to truly express or put to words how deeply I love you. There's so many reasons I love you, and I could go on forever, but it's because you're so unapologetically yourself, and your energy is contagious. You make everyone around you feel so loved, which in return makes you so easy to love. You truly are my golden retriever and my person. <laughs> I'm not. I'm ready for I don't this. Know how you're... <laughs> <laughs> I'm, gonna... I'm already a mess. <laughs> Oh, this is how I am with you. How am I going to be with Luke? <laughs> perfect. Oh, okay. You're going to be perfect. I promise to love you unconditionally and continuously work on growing our relationship together. I love how our relationship started with an unbreakable friendship and I promise to be your best friend for eternity. I promise to be the best wife I can possibly be. I love you so much, Luke, and I truly don't know what I ever did without you. Oh, man, I'm excited. So, I mean, I can look. <laughs> oh my goodness. I wasn't expecting it, but it looks amazing. Oh my, <laughs> bro, you're a queen. <laughs> Holy cow, that is elegant and amazing. Oh, oh you look amazing. Thank you. Oh. Hey, I love that. You like it? That is amazing. I, I had a picture in my head that was kind of like, Oh, yeah, see, like, kind of like this. I expect like this on your torso, but e this is even better. This is so beautiful. And then that long, <laughs> that is, oh my word, you're like a movie star. <laughs> Thank you. That was amazing. Stay. I love you. I love you. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Go. Ah. <laughs> 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 
I'm scared. I'll support you. Look at the mountain. Look at the sunset. Why do we not live here? Uh, because I don't want to. I know. I should have went first. <laughs> if I'm being honest, this was the part I was most nervous about, and for two reasons. First reason being that this was literally the only thing I dreamt about in relation to our wedding, and it was that I forgot my vows. So that was a stressful night, and I was relieved to wake up and realize it wasn't reality. But the second reason is that vows are extremely important and mean a lot to me, as I hope they do to you as well. So it's a lot of pressure to get them just right and deliver them in the way I want. Just know that I mean what I'm about to say with all my heart. I promise to give you the love and attention you deserve so you never feel neglected or mistreated. I promise to always be your best friend and be by your side so you will never feel alone. I knew I wanted to be your best friend and even told you with confidence the night we met that we were going to be. I'm sure you thought I was crazy. Then I got to know you more and more. First it was the football obsession, then it was the Spider-Man suit, and after I learned about your singing and dance moves I knew you were just as crazy as me. But all these things are why I fell in love with you. Especially the time I found you locked out of your apartment with nothing on except your Spider-Man suit. <laughs> That's definitely when I knew you were the one. I haven't played this in forever. Brush my hair. Do that little thing. Got a plan here? No. I promise to protect you from the terrible things of this world as long as I live. With all five, six, and 142 pounds of myself. I promise to always have a high level of patience with you, even in moments where we may disagree. For example, on Sundays when you say that seven hours of commercial free football is too much, I may disagree with you, but then I will do my best to take a deep breath and realize I can take a five minute break. But in all seriousness, Bailey, I love you so much and I promise to always love you. I vow to be the best husband I can be to you along with the best future father to our kids that I can possibly be. I love you. Till I go